G'day, Glenn Morris here from the Smart Energy Lab. And I'm here today with Shirley from AESOM at the All Energy Expo. It's amazing, here on day one. Now, so Shirley, tell me about this new battery. So this is a sodium battery. Sodium battery is a new battery in the industry that uh, not many people are releasing yet. We are the first one releasing in Australia. Uh, the sodium batteries we have so far is for the automotive part. And the uh, technology of the sodium compared to lithium is sodium have so much power. Um, and also pricing wise, it's very uh, cost effective. Um, the sourcing of the lithium, it's um, it's all over the world, but the sodium is actually um, have more resources. So that's why we're keen to develop the new battery, which is sodium battery. Um, sodium battery right now, it's being used uh, with automotive, but as well as the, um, the residential, the solar side. We are looking at have the 100 amp hour battery, sodium battery, uh, for the use of solar uh, energy storage. Uh, right now we have the sodium here. Um, the temperature ranges of sodium is from minus 40 degrees to 80 degrees. Um, so in terms of the power um, of the battery, that can be done very uh, well with the cold um, temperature. It's so much better than uh, lithium. Um, so in terms of the extreme weathers, you don't have to worry about it. Uh, that's very good size. And in terms of um, sodium wise, it does have in 12 volt, 48 volts, so we can range it in different uh, amp hours and also the different capacity in terms of the sizes. Um, so far, we've got the uh, batteries for car batteries and also truck batteries. So that's uh, pretty much we are working on, and this is the new released in the whole industry here. Yeah. Right, so this battery is designed for a vehicle, it looks like a standard car battery, yep. but you said it's um, suitable for up to 80 degrees Celsius, which yep. under the bonnet of the car is pretty, pretty, pretty typical, yep. uh, whereas a, a conventional lithium battery would struggle. 100%. So the, that's the pretty good point of the sodium is the durability, um, how it's uh, standing like in the cold weather and also the extreme hot weather. So we are very comfortable because it's safer um, compared to lithium. It might have the fire uh, risky. So that's why we recommend it to people to using sodium now. Uh, it's so much safer um, and easy, easy to use. Is it uh, cheaper or more expensive than lithium? Uh, it will be cheaper, way cheaper than lithium. Why, why would it be cheaper? Um, as you know, sodium is pretty, um, you know, good resources from the earth. You can find a lot of them compared to lithium. They're from the mining side. Uh, it takes time. Sodium wise, it's everywhere. Uh, you know, it's even in your everyday salt uh, that you can, you know, get in the sodium. Um, so that's why uh, we are considering this why it's so much cheaper and we can get the price down. Uh, not only because the demand should be picking up, but also we want to, you know, make everyone affordable for, for buying the, the batteries. I believe it's also safer, like if you over discharge the battery? Yes, it, it will be definitely safer uh, because it's acting material wise is different with lithium is, you know, it's very unstable, uh, but sodium wise is so much stable than the, um, the lithium element itself, yeah. Now you mentioned the manufacturing of these. What is the plan for manufacturing? Uh, look, we are looking at manufacturing locally in Australia, actually, one day. But because we're just launching this sodium, we're trying to see how the market responds. So if yeah, we, well, if it's popular, then we'll definitely make it localized, and you know, it'll be made in Australia products. Fantastic! That's great to hear. And I believe that you have plans for bigger than just the, the 12 volt battery. Yes, absolutely. So we not only have the 12 volt, but we will have the 48 volt as well applied to the residential batteries. Um, that will be releasing next year. Um, that's the different, pretty much different structure because uh, we will be suitable for the residential areas. The cases wise, it will be so much different. Uh, this 12 volt is just pretty much standard. Um, so we will have them make more series and more, make more ranges as well. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Shirley. I'm very excited about what ASON are doing with sodium. Thank you. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you, Glenn. Thank you.
Wow, that was pretty interesting. Seeing a sodium ion battery that will soon be made in Australia by AESON. Sodium, I'm excited. I think lithium's going to be a challenge going forward because of resource scarcity. Sodium ion, based on sodium, which is basically in every <laughs> the oceans of the world, it's in your kitchen in the form of salt. We're not running out of it. And the safety aspect, the fact that it has to get up to 800 degrees Celsius to go into thermal runaway, <laughs> uh, it's a very safe product. So yeah, thanks Aeson for showing me the sodium ion battery. Check it.